What is good, you guys? Shiwani, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. My name is Lenny Kosa, and you are about to subscribe. Today's video is a hair installation tutorial. It's giving clean girl, it's giving clean installation, it's giving fresh install, it's giving new hair, new me child. So yeah, um, just stay tuned, continue watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Bye. Bye. Okay, so I put on two sticking wig caps. I normally do this when my hair is not braided in wig lines, just to make sure that my the wig stays on flat. And then I go in with the glamour spray. I use three layers. I applied the first layer, dried out with a blow dryer on low heat, and then go in with the second layer and repeat until the third layer. Okay, now I'm putting on the wig. Now um, the, the glue is now tacky. Then I put it on and just make sure that it's sitting in the right position. You'll see me adjusting it um, a lot because I want to make sure that it's sitting properly because once it, it lays, it lays like it's stuck and it will be very painful to try and shift it when it's already stuck okay so i use <laughs> okay so i use a rexal comb to just um make sure that it's stuck okay. Okay, so now I'm applying the glamour spray. I now go in with, in smaller sections with the glamour spray. Um, this, this is just to make sure that the lace is melted and it doesn't lift. This step, if I don't do it, my lace will lift like in about two days. And I think we are trying to achieve the stay two weeks with the glamour sp with the wig on, right? So this is the step that you need to take into consideration if you want to if you want your list to stay at least two weeks okay? um so i apply and then use a blow dryer to melt it to melt the lace and then i'm gonna go in again on the other section on the other half of my head and then use a blow dryer again Once that is done, I'm going to go in with the micellar water by Pawns and I'm just going to rub my forehead just to remove any excess glue that I get when you are spraying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
it just drops your dripper on your skin so i'm just removing all of that excess um thingy then i'm gonna go in with my foundation yeah like well done wet and wild <laughs> and then, um now people are, are using rain powder i haven't tried using powder i'm gonna try it one day and i'm going to let you guys know how that went but for now let's use the the the, the thingy foundation just to match the lace to with our skin right So an alternative yes spirit you can use um, um, a mousse to make your lace invisible. You guys are going to see how this does the job also just as good as the spritz. Right? So if you don't have mousse, if you don't if you don't have spritz, you can use mousse. You'll see your lace will thank you. Look at mine. You can't even tell where the lace is. We're saying 